Hi everyone, I'm Walt Gray. Here's what's happening. Sacramento County health officials are now shifting away from the 14-day coronavirus quarantine guidance for some people. Up until now, many public health officials had encouraged people who might have come in contact with a coronavirus patient to self-quarantine at home for 14 days. Now they say it is no longer necessary. The county is still asking people who are showing or developing respiratory symptoms to still, though, stay at home. Deputies are looking for whoever is responsible for leaving a person dead and three others hurt in a shooting just south of Ceres. It happened Sunday night on Spruce Avenue. We spoke to a woman who lives across the street. She said she heard about 15 gunshots. If you know anything, please contact sheriff's deputies in Stanislaus County. A civil rights attorney is filing a lawsuit against the Sacramento Police Department for a shooting that happened at a Midtown Safeway in December. Police say officers asked Kevin Cole to leave the property several times. When he refused, an officer tried to arrest him. That's when Cole's dog launched at an officer, biting him. Shots were fired, and Cole and a security officer were hit by shrapnel. The lawsuit alleges false arrest, excessive force, and assault and battery. All right, let's see what's happening with our forecast. Rob checks in now with that. All right, this is going to be a very split forecast. In our local area, and I'm talking about Yuba City, Marysville, probably most of the Bay Area, Sacramento, maybe even Stockton as well, you're going to have sunny skies, highs in the 70s, and overall a nice day. But once you start to get to Turlock, Modesto, right along that line, you'll see it's a very different world. That's when you're going to start to see a few scattered light showers. I would say the very southern end of the San Joaquin Valley, uh, you're going to be looking at some thunderstorms as well, maybe even some strong thunderstorms. And then Southern California is going to be dealing with at least a couple days of rain. So again, it's a very split world once you get, I would say, south of Modesto, or maybe even including Modesto today and tomorrow, but just at the fringe, uh, once you get south of that, then we're looking at some rain and some stormy conditions. Uh, the storms for Northern California start to show up this weekend. Saturday morning, the snow starts. Then later on in the afternoon, we are looking at some rain. This does extend through Sunday and maybe even a little bit left over on Monday morning. This is rain. This is snow for two, maybe three days. It's not a terribly strong storm, but I think each day we could get a quarter inch of rain <clears throat> which is pretty solid and the most rain we've seen in a while. And then we'll start to see things wind down past the weekend. So again, everything is fine for the most part in Northern California until you get to about the San Joaquin Valley and then heads up, watch for clouds or more. And then our rain is coming this upcoming weekend.